Okay. So where are we are right now? Just do that again, please. Here. This, so is, this is about uh, 1,880 meters. Yes, exactly. So you 180 meters deep? One, yeah, yeah, 180 meters deep. Okay. And the chain is at that point is 1,880. And what type of rock is this? Uh, lead exotic gneiss. There is few minor gneiss in the in the uh, end of the coal. And also there is small magnetic vein in the part of the history of all. And you would say this is very difficult to penetrate this rock? Uh, I would say that there is challenges to do uh, to do blasting holes and and do the blasting correctly and there is some some challenge. It's quite quite hard rock. You have yeah. to use high explosives? There is plenty of drill holes, something like a little, little bit more than 100 uh, drill holes with length is one, four and a half meter and there, those drill holes are filled uh, with explosives and afterwards. How much, how much rock would you get out with one blast? Do you know? Uh, I, don't, I don't remember. 180 because cubic meters. 180 80 cubic meters. More or less. Mm -hmm. That's a lot. That's a lot. That's a lot. Yes. Every day once, or is it uh, uh, the days? There is days when they do, do two rounds per day, but quite often, and the normal way is to do only one round per day. Mm -hmm. So it it continues and for four and a half meter or five meters per day. Okay. Is it a very dangerous work? Uh, I wouldn't say that. So no, it's there is the regulations are very high. Yes. The explosives, everything are designed for the safety. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, gentlemen. What's, what's this thing here? This, uh, th this is the most important instrument uh, in excavating the tunnel, the drilling jumbo. So there are three uh, three uh, drilling blades um, three drilling axes uh, which can be uh, operated at the same time drilling into the tunnel face uh, holes deep in um, let's say five meters and it takes about four hours to drill uh, over 100 holes into the tunnel face for, for charging the explosives Mm -hmm. into the holes. And it's data control. You see uh, oh, this, uh, this uh, charging uh, uh, charging can be uh, uh, can be uh, I'm listening. You see uh, charging of the hole of the, of the yeah, holes? charging of the holes can be can be programmed oh. beforehand so so that when you start drilling uh, the driver doesn't have to do anything. Mm -hmm. He just sees how, how it performs. Goes. Yes. Uh -huh. So everything is computerized. Yes, and um, and you can change the the, uh, the uh, let's say the pattern. Mm -hmm. It's the pattern of of uh, drilling those holes into the tunnel face. You can change it uh, depending on on, for instance, uh, the uh, hardness of the of the rock and so on. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's this thing here? This, uh, th this is the most important instrument uh, in excavating the tunnel, the drilling jumbo. So there are three, uh, three uh, drilling blades, um, three drilling axes, uh, which can be uh, operated at the same time, drilling into the tunnel face uh, holes deep in, um, let's say, five meters. And it takes about four hours to drill 
over 100 holes into the tunnel phase for, for charging the explosives mm -hmm. into the holes. And it's data control. You see uh, this, uh, this uh, charging uh, uh, charging can be uh, uh, can be. Uh, I'm listening. You see. Uh, Charging of the hole of the, of the yeah, holes? charging of the holes can be can be programmed oh. beforehand, so so that when you start drilling, uh, the driver doesn't have to do anything. Mm -hmm. He just sees how how it performs. Goes. Yes. Uh -huh. So everything is computerized. Yes. And um, and you can change the the. Uh, Let's say the pattern. Mm -hmm. It's the pattern of, of uh, drilling those holes into the tunnel face. You can change it uh, depending on, on, for instance, uh, the uh, hardness of the of the rock and so on. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kim, what's this? What you have in your hand here? This, this is the drilling blade, which is put on the on the axis. Mm -hmm. And this goes round like this and makes a hole. Mm -hmm. Goes round very swiftly. Mm -hmm. What is what is it made of? It's um, industrial diamonds. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So, Timo, what is this here? This is the axis of the Onkalo characterization facility, mm -hmm. which goes as a spiral mm -hmm. uh, down to uh, 108 meters at the moment. Mm -hmm. And the final depth will be? Final depth, uh, well, uh, the uh, primary investigation level uh, is down to 420 meters depth. Mm -hmm. uh, a depth we should be reached by 2009. Mm -hmm. And um, down here will be the final repository of uh, well, nuclear waste to Finland. Well, into this facility we can't dispose anything. It's just for research to confirm the results we have gained uh, from the drillings uh, which have been conducted above ground. And now we are go going to confirm these results by doing this tunnel and going to the final disposal depth. And then we can, when we have reached this depth of, of, of 420 meters, we can start to locate uh, the uh, uh, bedrock blocks where to uh, uh, construct the final disposal tunnels surrounding this facility. Mm -hmm. Can you go inside? Yes. I could join in a second.